hello coming to you with three the number three three brands today we have Samoy, which is a gentle moisturizing lotion it is uh, made for young and delicate skin okay so again let me try saying it again it is say moi say moi meaning it's for me in english you can see that it's me yes again i put an extra word in there it's me is what it says in french oh i can't see that there we go maybe if i tilt it the light the light is so bright the colors on there are amazing though Okay, and then coming back, it says, mm, it has candula and elo. Ooh, I love candula. No animal testing, no fragrance, no parabens. Do, 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 do. And this is a 50 milliliter or a 1.7 full ounce. How much was this? Oh, these are all on sale right now. I don't remember the prices. I think they're around $6 possibly or lower. Mm. Okay. And, and they were found at CVS. And this is, these two right here are decollage, decollage, decollage. Decolletage. Decolletage. There you go. <sighs> okay. It only took three times for, on the fourth time to get it correct. Um, this right here is for normal to dry skin. Uh, directions. Smooth on to face, neck, and decolletage. After cleansing, ideal for use, bath, morning, and night. Decolletage. And this also is Weleda. Well done. Weleda. Well, uh, da. Well, uh, da. well uh, da. renewing night cream nightly hydration to support skin's vibrancy this one has wild rose extracts look at how beautiful that is this is a one full ounce for normal to dry skin Directions at bedtime, gently massage into face, neck, and decolletage after cleansing and toning. So we have these two products here are the same. Oh, and this one here, I forgot to mention, this one is prickly pear cactus extract. Something that has been coming up very often this year. People saying, cactus, cactus is good for you, aloe. Prickly pear extract. And this one again, wild rose extract. So, starting with the first one. Let's see what that looks like. And smells like. I believe that one's fragrance free. I believe that the cap is on still. Okay, so I will not be trying this one today. Oh, let's just take the cap off. Wait, is this is this all, is this on too or no? It's probably all on. Oh, let me see. No, this one not. This one apparently. Let me smell this one. I'm trying to smell a prickly pear. So I just, as you see there, put a little bit on. Mmm, rubbing it in. It, um, I really don't know what prickly pear just smells like, but I'd imagine it's something outdoorsy, and if that's the smell they were going for, it definitely smells light outdoorsy. What did you say? What did that smell like? It almost smells like a clay too, doesn't it? Like a clay you would put on or a paste that you would put on? 
It kind of smells like a clay that I'm really yeah. smelling all the other perfumes you sprayed. Yeah, I know. <laughs> Okay, let's see if I can smell this one because I was really wanting to see what this one smells like because I got really excited about that rose earlier. Mm, let's see here. The engineer. Screwing that there. Put a little bit on hill. Let's see what that smells like. This is the decolletage. Oh! Yeah, oh. Okay. That smells like rosy and it smells like beach, doesn't it? Doesn't it smell like a little beach? It smells like a little beach. It smells like a little beach at the beach. You know what? It's kind of thick though. That feels thick. That feels thick going on. That's a nighttime cream and hydration. Oh wow. Look at that. See that? That is definitely thick going on. Like if you need to hydrate. I'm sure most individuals do. It's summertime. Right here, this is a cream. Bedtime, nighttime. Put some of that on. I don't even think you need that much. You saw how much I used. I used just a little bit. A dot, and it's like covering pretty much the front and the back of my hand here. Just doing this back and forth, and you can see it glistening. That it's pretty thick still. You can still probably maneuver it to the other hand and it'll soak right in. That is pretty amazing right there. You know what? I'm going to try the prickly pear because now I'm interested on the prickly pear to see if it's just as thick. I mean, I don't think it was as thick. That one was like really caught my attention because that was like super thick. This looks also very glistening. This looks very glistening. Definitely a lot lighter. And this right here again is day. Daily cream. Sheer hydration. It's definitely thinner. It feels like it goes on silkier. It's light. Definitely smooth. Okay, so yeah, I can definitely tell a difference between the two. This one is definitely a lot lighter. And I don't know if you can see there. This one is definitely a lot thicker. It glistens more, and this one's definitely a lot smoother. Still glistens. Definitely a lot lighter, though. You can see the difference between the shine. This one is a dark shine here. Like a brighter shine, just it's a lot thicker, the hydration. And then you have the other one, which is a smoother Still a hydration, just lighter. So that's the difference between the two. And then again, obviously the scents. You have the rose and then you have the prickly pear. So and let's see, this is the other one. I have to open this one up though. This one was not opened. So I will try to open this one up really quick and see because I'm interested now to see I'm playing with the other two, what that smells like. Again, I think it's probably, I want to say a little bit more comparison to smell to that there. I'm going to put a drop there. And then I'm going to close that up right there. And I'm going to rub this in here. See what that feels like. That also, that feels like, as you can see too, it comes off like it's a little bit thicker. So you kind of keep having to rub it in. But I'm sure if you're rubbing it in all over the place, probably soak up really quick. Again too, that feels like it comes on thick. And this is a cream, like a lotion. Um, it feels like, yeah, it's a bit thick on your skin. Which is, again, probably pretty good for the summertime. It doesn't feel greasy, though. It definitely feels like a thicker cream, though, putting it on. Like it's leaving, like, a layer, top layer on to, like, moisturize. 
but at the same token, it also feels like it's being absorbed um, by your skin. And you can see it doesn't leave, it does leave a little bit of a shine, but not a heavy shine. And it feels nice actually putting it on. That one is a little perfumey, huh? It's a light, it has a light perfume scent to it. So, I mean, if you want the really thick one, again, it was the hydrating one. Um, nighttime one, the rose one. So if you're going to go to bed, maybe say, maybe you have, you know, come in tired, put this on, you're drying everything, leave it on overnight. In the morning, you can just wash it off. And I'm pretty sure you still have a glow to you next morning and still look good and not really have to put too much on, you know, but it's still kind of like on your skin. This one here, I can also see it. Possibly depending on like how your night is, you know, I mean if you have like a hot sticky night This one you might have to replenish more but again, it says daily. So it's just a sheer But it looks like it keeps you hydrated your skin looking nice and moisturized as you can see you just look nice and moisturized See there's a bit of a glow, but it's not too much But you probably would have to reapply that there and then this one here uh, again, probably closer to the hydrating cream, the moisturizing lotion. It is gentle, feels nice, and again, it leaves your skin, again, looking silky. And you can feel, you still feel like the cream on top, but it's not like thick. And I'm sure as the day goes by too, it will like absorb more, you know. Just keep the health, the skin looking healthy and hydrated uh, throughout the day. So, again, it has like a glistening to it, a glow, which some people look for because they don't want to look so dry and ashy during the summer. So, all in all, all three products are very nice. This is the lightest one here. You can wear that glistening sheer hydration if you just need a light, smoother hydration is the prickly pear cactus and then it would be the nighttime so this would be the heaviest one so in order from the lightest to medium to the other but this is also very close to that one there if you want a thicker cream on and to hydrate like you really need to just hydrate your skin it would probably be that one there okay thank you for watching you have any questions no no questions Alrighty. thank you have a good day